Hi friends, I am Balaji Rao. Welcome to BR Max class. In previous class, we learned the definition of a matrix, what is order of a matrix and how we represent a matrix. In this class, we will learn the definition of row matrix, the definition of column matrix, definition of square matrix and the definition of rectangular matrix. First, you see this row matrix. What is row matrix? A matrix which is having only one row is called row matrix. It is easy definition only. If a matrix is having only one row, only one row is called row matrix. You observe this is the example for row matrix. In this matrix, how many rows are there? How many columns are there? One row and three columns. This is the matrix which is having only one row. That's why this is the example for row matrix. You observe this matrix. This matrix is of order 1 by 2. How many rows are there? Only one row is present. That's why this is the example for row matrix. You observe this is the matrix of order 1 by 5. One row, 5 columns are there. This is the matrix having only one row. So it is called a row matrix. Now we will learn what is column matrix. You see this column matrix. A matrix which is having only one column is called column matrix. A matrix which is having only one column is called column matrix. You observe this matrix. What is the order of this matrix 2 by 1? In this, two rows are there, one column is present. This is the matrix which is having only one column. That's why this matrix is example for column matrix. You observe this matrix. This matrix is of order 3 by 1. In this, three rows are present and one column is present. This is the matrix which is having only one column. So this is the example for column matrix. Now we will learn the definition of square matrix which is very very important. You see, what is square matrix? A matrix in which number of rows equal to number of columns. In a matrix, number of rows equals to number of columns then that matrix is called a square matrix. You observe this example. What is the order of this matrix? Order of this matrix is 2 by 2. So in this matrix number of rows equal to number of columns. So this is the example for square matrix. You observe this matrix. This is of order 1 by 1. One row is present, one column is present. Is it is the example for square matrix? Of course. It is a square matrix because number of rows equal to number of columns. You observe this matrix. It is a square matrix or not? Yes, because number of rows equal to number of columns. One important note, A is a square matrix of order 3. What it mean? In which number of rows and number of columns both are equal to 3. For example, you see, we can say this as square matrix of order 2. Square matrix of order 2 means it contains 2 rows, 2 columns. This is square matrix of order 1. This is square matrix of order 3. We use this notation frequently while doing exercise problems. A is a square matrix of order 3. It means this is a matrix of order 3 by 3. Now we will try to understand what is rectangular matrix. Rectangular matrix. A matrix in which number of rows not equal to number of columns. A matrix in which number of rows not equals to number of columns then it is called a rectangular matrix. You observe this example. This is the matrix of order 2 by 3. In this two rows are there and three columns is present. Number of rows is same as number of columns? No. So this is the example for rectangular matrix. A matrix in which number of rows not equal to number of columns. You see this example. This is the matrix of order 1 by 3. In this one row is present and three columns are present. So number of rows not equal to number of columns. So this is the example for rectangular matrix. In next class, we will learn what are principal diagonal elements? What is diagonal matrix? What is scalar matrix? All those things we will learn in next class.